hundreds of billions of dollars uh, has been put at risk because the Houthis have held uh, this area in the Red Sea um, at ransom. Sorry, so just let me get this straight, Yelda. So we are bombing the poorest, one of the poorest countries in the world that has been under a humanitarian blockade. There has been famine. These people have been decimated. And we are bombing them because a couple of guys in dinghies in support for the Palestinians who are having a genocide committed against them. They're objecting to that and we're bombing them. Come on now. I mean, well, this it, is just I, an insane world for us to even think. I'm so sorry your Amazon packages are delayed. I really am. Like, I wish mine came on time. But, you know, genocide, guys, genocide. There are two mothers a day dying in Gaza right now. It's 109 days into a conflict in which a humanitarian crisis has been declared to the world day but by in, the way, day uh, out. By the way, Dr. Frank. These people are creating a total trade um, blockade, um, which is causing inflation, which is causing all sorts of problems to everybody. 25,000 people are dead in Gaza right now. There are over 60,000 people injured with no access to food, water, aid. How dare we have a conversation about trade when there are children right now being treated without anesthetic? Well, the there are things that, that require us to make some sacrifices, have the, and this would be I one mean, of they, them. They do have the global economy, global markets hostage. Good for them. Bill Brother. <laughs> Good for it, them. It, it, Cease it, fire now. Cease fire now. <laughs> We're going to have to uh, leave.